Hey YouTube, hope everybody's doing good. It's been a while. Uh, I just wanted to go over our 150 gallon aquarium here we got that we set up a few months ago. It's been running since I want to say around uh, March or April. Very good, very smooth. I love this aquarium. It's my dream setup. Today we're going to go over all the equipment we have, uh, the pumps, the sumps, uh, and all the cool gadgets we have. All right, so the sump we have on this is a Traeger System Sapphire. It's the 34 series. Um, right now, I have it running with uh, filter sock, two filter socks. I have 250 watt heaters from Bulk Reef Supply. We have an Inkbird heater controller. I have two dosing pumps for dosing fertilizers and iron. We're also running CO2 injection on this. We have a CCHE 7.0 Wi-Fi controlled pump that does up to 1900 gallons per hour. We also have an ATO reservoir, Sapphire as well to match the sump. And we're running the Reef Breeders ATO pump. We're also running the Felix smart system on that, which is great. I love the Felix smart system. It lets me see what's going on with the, with the tank at all times. I can check to see the uh, pH levels. I can check the temperature. I can check the TDS. I can also check the um, ammonia levels. It'll also, it'll also uh, detect the ammonia levels in it as well. So that's all the stuff down in the filtration. Now on this sump, um, I set it up a little bit differently where I have a DF filter socks, but they get dirty so fast um, that I decided to also add some matten filters as well, different sizes in the first chamber here. So if it starts overflowing, they'll catch all the extra debris in the tank. And then I'm running the Seachem Matrix uh, Media I have uh, a lot of it in there in the media bag. I also have a, a matrix carbon as well. And then, like I said, I'm running the CJ 7.0 pump. It's a really good setup. I like it a lot. There's some things I'd like to change, um, but overall it, it does a very good job. As far as lighting, I'm right, running the uh, AI um, 32 Hydras. I also have an AI Nero 3.0 flow control pump in here. And then you got my beautiful discus, my altums, nice piece of driftwood. Came out really good. Uh, the stand I built myself, I just gotta do a couple finishing uh, touches on the paint. Came out really good. It's got a, a Synergy Systems overflow in the back there. And the aquarium itself is a uh, SD Aquariums um, old, low iron glass, very nice build very clean overall just a very good looking tank and uh, I'm very very happy with it do me a favor if you like the video hit the like button and subscribe if you have any questions just shoot me a shoot me a question on the comments section area I'll answer them the best I can and we're gonna be doing a video coming up also on what's in the aquarium and also my likes and dislikes about the aquarium so I just want to say thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate you guys staying uh, true and subscribing. I uh, really appreciate it. You guys have a great day. Bye.